has done very well at the Faceoff X this season, over 61% on the year. Luke Weirman has done a tremendous job there, 62 for 96 this year. And where he's really dangerous is not only winning it, but he has the green light to push the ball off the faceoff. He has four goals this, he this year so far. Yeah, Maryland is a team that likes to push off of winning those face-offs. They average 17 and a half goals per game. Both of these teams, high-powered offenses. Notre Dame, not quite as potent in that game against Georgetown, but they did score 24 goals in the opener against Detroit Mercy. And really, that second half against Georgetown was impressive for the Irish in the way that they bounced back. And so something like that will show up here today against number one, Maryland. As you see, Kevin Corrigan in his 34th season leading Notre Dame. Two tremendous head coaches, John Tillman on the other side for Maryland in his 12th year. A lot of mutual respect between these two coaches and these two programs. Opening face-off, one back for Notre Dame, and that's important for Will Lynch. Quarterfinal, a little bit of momentum in terms of that chip on the shoulder, and the Irish are looking to bounce back, and they have another face-off win from Lynch. Shelf open for him to bury it. And Liam Entman, very strong goalie for this Notre Dame team, but not much of a chance there against Wisnowskis. Nick Harris. Faceoff. Notre Dame is three for three on faceoffs today, but Maryland gets a win here from Weirman. Not quite unable to handle it. As here's Hagstrom. Bring it the other way for Notre Dame. And that pass sails way over the head of Kavanaugh, so it brought them to this Maryland program. He's built a tremendous culture, a culture not just based around winning lacrosse games, but also building some great student athletes to go on and make an impact in the world after their time. At He's that open man and ties the game up. And when we talked to Coach Tillman, he mentioned that Kyle Long, it, it might not always be lighting up the stat sheet, but he does all of the little things right. He's the most complete lacrosse player that they have on their roster made that save yeah, how about that going right off the shoe there into the back of the net violation on the face off so Maryland will take possession to go second quarter knotted up at three at Kavanaugh with the goal but Maryland with the face off win quarter already three just over five minutes into the second what have they been doing better offensively well it looks like picking their spots when they're shooting you've seen a few of these drop not necessarily missing the net and getting just too easy for them Baglisi with his third goal of the year and now we are in with a face-off win they've gone nearly 10 minutes without a goal in this second quarter, but they get one by near the end of the half. But Weirman with a key face-off win has it ripped away. Jason Reynolds had the cause turnover. It's still loose near goal line extended. And a whistle will give it back to Notre Dame. Maryland had the edge six to five in face-off wins in the first half. It'll be Luke Weirman going up against Will Lynch. And Weirman doing a really nice job with some physicality there. Step, even with the defender on his hands, he turns the hips and finishes the shot. And Weirman with an easy face-off win there for the Terrapins. Yes. Two goals for Maryland in a minute and 13 seconds. Brian, you talked about that quick strike last year in the quarterfinal. They had three goals in less than a minute. Two goals very early into this second half on Will Lynch on this faceoff. You don't want Maryland to start that make it, take it, but Maryland with another faceoff win. Irish. Bryce Walker from Austin, the all-time points leader at Westlake High School. Looking to be the star lacrosse coming from Jack Brennan. And the Terrapins with another faceoff win. Brian, you mentioned that was starting to change. It was six to five at halftime in favor of Maryland. They've won every faceoff in this third quarter. 
It's Notre Dame with seven goals this season. And Notre Dame nearly had the faceoff win. Ball is still loose. And it is scooped up by the Terrapins. John Gep to score another goal. Weirman with the faceoff win with one second. He's taken down to win this game. Faceoff between Colin Hagstrom and Luke Weirman. Maryland came away with it initially, but then a quick turnover as the B.O. run for Notre Dame has pulled the Irish within one. Violation on the faceoff will give it to Maryland. Goal edge. Nine to five. And it was a 3-0 run before that response from Oliver. Day for Jack of Boys. He had four goals in that quarterfinal game last year. So back to a one-goal game, Maryland with possession. I along with a four-point day, two goals, two assists. Showing why he's on the Twarton Award watch list heading into this season. Notre Dame scoops up the ground ball with Reynolds.